A key step in making your videos look more professional and cinematic is to color correct all of your footage so that you can even out the lighting and the color tone across all of your clips. But learning how to color correct your footage can be extremely daunting and time consuming, especially if you're new to video creation. That is why we've made it easier than ever for you to color correct your footage as well as add additional filters to change the mood and tone of your videos with our adjust color mode. And the icing on the cake is that it works seamlessly even with 4K footage. You can easily access this feature first by clicking on the clip on your canvas and then selecting the adjust color mode on top of your canvas. This will open up a menu with several advanced controls in the left hand side panel. Here you can adjust the white balance, the tone, sharpness, blur and more. Now to adjust the white balance in your clips, you can play around with the temperature and tint slider. If your clip is too warm or too yellow, slide the temperature control to the left. And if your clip is too blue or too cool, slide the temperature control to the right till you achieve a balanced look. Note the setting for your first clip so that you can replicate it for the rest of your clips. The tint slider can help you balance out any one hue that might be overpowering your frame. For instance, we can see there's a lot of green in this clip. So we will just introduce a hint of pink to cancel out the greens and balance the footage out. To adjust the tone of your video, you need to play around with the brightness, contrast, saturation and exposure of your clips. The brightness slider increases or decreases the overall brightness of your frame while still keeping the details intact. Next, you can use the contrast slider to increase or decrease the difference between the shadows and the highlights within your frame. And finally, you can use the saturation slider to enhance or decrease the intensity of all of the colors in your clips. On the other hand, the exposure slider increases or decreases the intensity of the highlights in your frame. To enhance the sharpness and crispness of your frame, you can play around with the sharpness slider, which will enhance the intensity of the edges of things and people within your frame to make them look more crisp. And if you want to blur out any part of your footage, you can do that using the blur slider. You can play around and experiment with all of these settings till you get the look and feel that you desire. Alternatively, you can also experiment with the filters and apply a completely different look to your clips all at once. Simply hover over the filter to see what it looks like on your clip. Once you're happy with the filter that you want, click on it so that it gets applied and then you can play around with the intensity slider to see what amount is absolutely perfect for your video clip. Say goodbye to overly complicated color correction processes and make your videos look more cinematic in minutes with our adjust color tool. This is Aditi with InVideo and I will see you in the next one.